Before you go shopping for supplies at your local hardware store or Home Depot, let's go over what aquaponics is all about. Aquaponics blends the best aspects of traditional aquaculture with the more modern hydroponics method of plant growth. Aquaponics, according to many fans and expert practitioners, solves the disadvantages of the two earlier systems by making everything cleaner and easier to manage. A balanced system. Any biological system that wants to thrive needs to be balanced. A system of aquaponics is no exception. The interaction of three major players in this type of biological system achieves balance, the fish, the plants, and the bacteria. That's right, an aquaponics system cannot function without microorganisms. Or it will require 10 times as much effort to keep it going. When you have an aquaponics system in place, this is what happens. Freshwater fish, such as tilapia, swim around in around 1,000 to 2,000 liters of water in one area of the system. When you feed the fish, waste material is produced. Unused fish feed also ends out in the water as waste. Ammonia is a chemical that your fish will make. Because the fish regularly produce waste matter and ammonia, the water in one portion of the system becomes extremely nasty after a while, as you might expect. Bacteria come to the rescue in this situation. Naturally occurring bacteria begin to develop in the water over time. Bacteria like Nitrobacter are capable of breaking down the ammonia that the fish produce on a regular basis. Nitrates are created after the bacteria have finished digesting the ammonia, which might cause toxicity in the water. Nitrates are waste products that are commonly found in aquariums and other aquatic environments. Nitrates can also cause difficulties in large concentrations because these byproducts foster the growth of undesirable vegetation in the water. That's where the plants come in to help restore the system's balance. Plants have no problems dealing with nitrates. Nitrates are a type of natural fertilizer found in plants. So you have fish that produce ammonia in one portion of an aquaponics system and consequently, nitrates. Plants in another part of the system literally absorb nitrates and other waste materials found in the water. The plants use all of the undesired waste produced by the fish component of the system to help the plants flourish. Water from the fish area is circulated several times a day so that the plants can filter and clean it.